So I got my first paycheck and first thing I did was go buy some sushi and second thing I did was this. This morning the postman rang at the door and brought this package and it's from Sephora! I'm so excited! In case you didn't know, I live in Germany and in Germany there's no Sephora. Like, nowhere. And shipping to Germany is really expensive at Sephora and I did it anyway, so... <laughs> and it has my address on there, so I have to be careful not to show you. <laughs> I mean, I feel a little bit guilty, but like I never spend that much money on makeup, so... Yep. Worth it. I have never done an unboxing video before, but... I really enjoy watching them, so I decided to make one and I hope you enjoy it a little bit. I don't even know if anyone's interested, but I don't care. I don't care. I'm filming this. I'm putting this on the internet. So I'm just gonna open this for everyone to see how I hurt myself with scissors because I'm clumsy as hell. Almost snipped my finger off there. I did not expect this to arrive in Germany so fast, like I ordered this three days ago. I was thinking about getting some fake tan for my Irish dancing competition, but I thought it would not get here in time. And now it did, and now I feel stupid that I didn't buy a fake tan. So this, what's this? Oh yeah, I, I got some samples with it, which is nice. How do I open this? Can you guess by my face which products are in here? I'm not wearing any lip products because this is lipsticks only. If you like unboxing videos just let me know and maybe I'll do some more if I buy more stuff. Which is uh, most certainly going to happen. <laughs> so this is what it looks like inside. And let me just get the paper out of the way. What's this? This is one of the samples I got. It's the Rita Hazen New York True Color Shampoo. Which I may or may not have bought because of this. Which is going to happen. In case you can't see, this is hair color. This is pink hair dye. So, little spoiler, this is going to happen anytime soon. That's why I chose this sample, Color Protect Shampoo, whatever. And I've also got the Scent Pores to the Shrink stuff, whatever this is. And this is the First Aid Beauty Ultra Repair Hydro Firm Sleeping Cream. I don't care too much about the samples. Much more important is this! Oh no. Oh no, they didn't. I found the fourth color. So I went nuts. I basically bought four of the Kat Von D Everlasting Liquid Lipsticks because nothing ever stays on my lips. Like I even high-end lipsticks. For example, I have the MAC lipsticks and they fade so fast on me, like it's not even funny. And I heard great things about these, so I bought them. To get these was a long journey. I ordered these off the Kat Von D beauty site and I got an order confirmation and after one week I wanted to track my package and I found out that the order was cancelled and I was like, what? Why? Turns out they don't ship to Germany. So, when I found these on the Sephora site, I was very excited. I got Lolita, of course. How could I not get Lolita? Vampira, Nosferatu and Double Dare. Now, Vampira is a gift for a friend, so I'm not going to unbox and swatch this one. But these ones I'm going to swatch now. This is... Lolita. This is Double Dare. And the last one is Nosferatu, which is a deep dark red. Oh, so beautiful! Everything wears off on my lips, and I hope that these don't. 
Let me just swatch these. Packaging is so pretty. Oh yes. Wow. Okay, so um, this one right here, that's Lolita. This is Double Dare and that one is Nosferatu. All of these are very popular shades and I am very lucky that they were in stock when I wanted to buy them. Especially Lolita, like, it's out of stock all the time and I got my hands on it and it makes me so happy. I am going to try out Lolita first. Just because it's the most popular shade and makes me very curious. This immediately feels really nice. It doesn't really smell like anything. Wow. This is so pretty. Also, it's called Lolita. Obviously, I had to get it. I don't even know how to describe shades, so I'm just... I'm not even gonna attempt it. I feel like I'm going to be wearing this a ton. Okay, so I'm gonna wait for it to dry now and then I'm going to do the kiss test. So let's see how well the lipsticks can cope with some makeup remover. I'm hardcore doing this and it does not completely come off. This is amazing. Kiss test. There is nothing on my hand, literally, like... Wow. So this was really hard to get off and I have to go try out the other shades now. I'm now going to try on Double Dare, which is a bit more rosy and lighter than Lolita. I feel like this suits me a little bit better than Lolita. I am so impressed by these colors. This color I bought to go with my competition dress and I hope it suits the color. I will find out later but right now I'm just dying to put this on my lips. Like, this is weird that it comes popping out like that. Also I really suck at applying lip products so do not take this as a tutorial. This is amazing. I already love these products so, so much. I think this color suits my dress very well and it will look awesome on stage. Also, this makes my teeth very white, I think. So, and this one is for one of my friends, Vampira. Vampira is not her name, it's the name of the lipsticks and I hope she likes it. I picked a color that suits her very well and I will let you know what she thinks. This product feels so nice on my lips, like, like it's not even there. Except when I like put my lips together, I feel like it's not sticky or anything, it's just matte on matte if that makes sense. So yeah, that's everything. It might look like a, a teeny tiny haul for you, but I literally spent a hundred bucks on these things. That's because the shipping, the duties and the taxes are so damn expensive when shipping to Germany. I hope you liked this little video and yeah. I have a few very exciting videos coming up, including this and also the world championships of Irish dancing are literally in two weeks. I'm so excited and I'm planning on doing a little vlog as my Orachtos vlog was very popular. It has more than 1000 views and I'm so thankful for that. I, I'm just happy that people watch my videos. Maybe I could give a few people who do not know about Irish dancing a teeny tiny insight of what it's like. 
and that makes me so happy. I always like introducing my sports to other people. So yeah, thanks for watching. Let me know in the comments what you think about videos like this, where I'm just kind of rambling about stuff that I bought that I don't even need, but uh, I hope you're having an awesome day and yeah. For more videos like this and for my exciting videos coming up, you can just subscribe to my channel and you will get a notification when those videos come up. And yeah, like this video as always. And I love you guys. Bye!